welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here my name is Taisha but you can call me Ty and I'm a makeup artist here in Brooklyn so today's video I want to show you guys how to do something really cute and simple for New Year's Eve so I'm gonna rush through this video a little bit my intro is not gonna be long because I'm actually running late I'm supposed to be at the dentist in like 15 minutes so I need to get out of here but if you guys want to see how I got this look that I think is perfect for New Year's it's something smoky but with a little bit of glitter I think this would be perfect for you guys just keep watching so today I'm going to be using two palettes for this look. I am using the Jaclyn Hill Volt Palettes. I am using Dark Magic and also Armed and Gorgeous. So the first color I'm going to dip into is in the Dark Magic Palette. I am going to be using Shush. And I'm going to use that as my transition shade. So if you hear that noise, that's just me tapping it off. Um, my brush, anytime I use any new eye, well, this isn't a new eyeshadow, but anytime I use an eyeshadow or do my eyes after I've done my face, I don't want any fallout. So I'll dip right into the palette and then brush it off and then go in on my eyes just because I don't want any fallout. My face is already done and I don't want it to get messed up. So I thought I was going to use two palettes, which was the Dark Magic palette and the uh, Arm and Gorgeous, but I'm not going to use Arm and Gorgeous. I'm going to put it aside. I'm going to make this look even more simple. So I really like how Shush came on. It came on pretty pigmented. I made sure I put a good amount on, so I'm not going to put on another brown shade like I thought I was. Not going to do that. What I am gonna do is dip into Mojo, which is this dark brown here. And I'm gonna put that right in my crease with a tapered blending brush. So you don't wanna bring this color up too high. You just wanna focus it right in the crease. And I know in all my videos, I keep using this Volt palette. And that's only because I haven't bought a lot of makeup this year. I haven't bought any. This is the last uh, makeup palette that I've bought. And I bought this back in the summer. I'm just, I'm really trying to focus on updating my, uh, I'm sorry, upgrading my makeup kit for my clients. So I haven't been buying anything for the channel well any eyeshadow palettes I'm really focusing on upgrading my um, kit with new foundations new concealers I want to get new highlighters um, more stuff that I want to contour with some powders so that's what I've really been focusing on so I haven't bought too many eyeshadow palettes and because of that I've just been using the vault because I don't want to um, okay I'm switching to a fluffy blending blush just to blend that out a little bit so there's no harsh lines but yeah, I don't want to use any of my other palettes. I have a lot of Morphe palettes or my Naked palettes, but some of those palettes are so old and you can't get them. So I don't want to use stuff on my channel or in the videos for you guys and it's something that you guys can't purchase if it's something that you want. So I've been using this because this is the most latest palette that I do have. So I'm just blending this out right here. I'm not raising it or going any higher just because... I don't want to bring this color too high. I just want to leave it right where it's at. Just want it to be blended well. So now we're going to dip into Temptress, which is the black shade. And I'm going to put that right on my lid. So you want to tap into this lightly. You don't want to pick up too much. You want to slowly build this up because with black you never know what's gonna happen and you want to tap this on really lightly you don't want to drag it no nope. just want to pat it on anytime you work with black pat it on so I totally forgot I wanted to use silver in this look and I put black over my whole eyes, so I'm gonna try to still add some silver in. Don't know how this is gonna go, 
but I'm gonna dip into Divergent and I'm gonna try to put that in the beginning of my lid. Let's see how this goes over the black. Not too bad. I'm gonna dip into Temptress a little bit and put a little bit in my crease just to smoke it out a little bit more. I'm just going right here. Going back to my blending brush, my fluffy blending brush, and just gonna blend that out a little bit. So I have these coaster glitters that I got from Amazon. I am going to put those on my lid. Well, not those. I'm gonna use the silver color. And I'm just gonna put some on my finger and then place it right on my lid. And I'm not doing the whole lid, just the beginning. So I'm gonna go put some liner on and some lashes and then I'll be right back. So I am back, I'm gonna do my under eyes now. So I'm gonna dip into Shush. I'm using a pencil brush and I'm just gonna run that right under my eye. Now I'm gonna dip into Mojo and I'm gonna put that under my eye too. Taking a random eyeliner I got from the beauty supply store, I'm gonna put that on my waterline as well. I need to sharpen this, but I'm in a rush, so I can't sharpen it right now. I'm just gonna have to make do. For lips, I am going in with my ColourPop Ultra Glossy Lip in the shade Finders Keepers. It's a pretty neutral shade. It's my first time actually really wearing it and trying it, but I thought this would be cute for this lip, for this look. And this is the finished look guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I wanted to give you guys something simple and easy, but really pretty for New Year's Eve. This will probably be my final tutorial for this year, my last tutorial for this year. So I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much who have been there to support me. I'm probably gonna do another video, but it won't be a tutorial showing you how to do a makeup look or anything like that. It's gonna be something different. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I hope you've been enjoying all my videos. If you, if so, guys, please thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.